Welcome to the world of tomorrow. Climb aboard. You are about to take a journey out of this world into the world of the future. Forget the world around you. Forget the people around you. You are entering Futurama alone with your own thoughts. Have you ever wondered where we will find the food, clothing, and shelter we will need to sustain the world's exploding population in the years ahead? In the timeless distances of outer space, perhaps? The technology of today is already helping us penetrate the silent darkness of space. Man himself has taken the first tiny step into this vast unknown, and we can only imagine what resources will soon be brought back to Earth by these early pioneers. But what about our own Earth? Are there not still resources here to meet the needs of the world tomorrow? What about that great unexplored continent at the bottom of our Earth, larger than the United States and Europe combined? Already Antarctica has become a great scientific laboratory for men of all nations to discover great new land areas rich with natural resources. Antarctica is but one area of great promise for the future. What about the others? What about the sea? We have long sailed its surface and fished its depths. But at the very bottom is a land of undreamed of abundance, with enough food to feed the Earth's population seven times over. There are rich ores and minerals carried by submarine trains to process stations on the coast. There is the water itself to be drained from the sea and made precious rain to turn desert lands into fertile lands. There will even be new areas for living and working, a whole new dimension of life for people of the future. Now, consider the thick, lush lands of the equator. Here, nature flourishes in its greatest abundance. Technology has finally led the way into the wild profusion of the jungle world. One day, this land will be transformed into land for farms and pastures for cattle. From the abundance of equatorial jungles to the barrenness of great mountain ranges, the future offers great promise. Once barriers to man's progress, the mountains will soon be traversed by multiple highways that will soar over canyons and cut through towering walls of granite. They will carry a life stream of minerals and other natural resources to the thriving industries of tomorrow. Highways, too, will open up the great expanses of desert lands, one day to be made fertile again by waters pumped from sea and river, from dam and mountain stream. The highways from great new centers of agriculture and industry will lead inevitably to the metropolis of tomorrow. Access will be easy to the heart of the city, the core. In and around great cities like this will live many of the people of the future, a future of limitless hope and promise. And nowhere will this be more evident to the homemaker than in the kitchen of the future. Remember the ultra-modern home exhibit you visited earlier today? The wonderful new concepts you saw in the kitchen? Yes, I couldn't believe it. That's certainly understandable. It's hard to believe there actually is an oven that can cook a roast in minutes by electronics. Then bake you potatoes in less time than it takes to carve the roast. And remember that new idea for the family that enjoys casual living. A refrigerated cart, ready for wheeling into a game room or out onto the patio. Perfect for keeping foods and drinks cool for informal entertaining. Yes, that's a wonderful idea. Now let's continue our journey into imaginative design and new concepts from the far corners of the world. <laughs>
quiet, just like being on the Mediterranean. Good heavens, I really am. How wonderful. Um, yummy. Fresh foods, too. My goodness, how can so much frozen food fit into such a small space? And no frost, either. this dishwasher holds. Well, I must say, I certainly am getting around. Now I seem to be in the exotic east. Sure use a good cup of tea about now. My, what a beautiful kitchen. What's over here? A laundry center. How convenient. And I'll bet this washer will get anything clean. Even my most delicate things. simple these controls are. <laughs> it happened again. And now I'm in the Orient. But look at that. A second oven. How wonderful. Just pull it out for easy cleaning. of refrigerator space and dust proof too. My, but something smells good over here. I'll have to sample that. Ooh, that's hot.
My family will never believe me. Hey, Mom, is dinner ready? Coming right up. How does it look? Delicious. Hi, Dad. Hi. Mmm, looks good. Well, I'll start the car. And you can tell us about going back to the World's Fair today. Did you have fun? I sure did. Everything I saw was out of this world. <laughs>